Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode eight of my Alp 17 season seven Let's Play for Experimental. We just finished the hoard, and I went around and I did all the repairs that I could. They broke a lot of blocks, uh, but only managed to break four the main structural blocks and none of them were like duplicates like there was never more than one block broken in any one column um, and hardly any damage to the other ones where there was a block broken so it, it looks like it's it's pretty random where they they do the damage and they did do most of the damage to the wood um, and that's fine. They can break all the wood they want. <laughs> I got a tree bar. <laughs> and the wood isn't going to... Them breaking the wood isn't going to make the base fall down. So I was very pleased with... Uh, with that. On the other hand... They did break every single... Uh, ladder that they could. Like... Uh, at the very least on every side there was at least two ladders the bottom two ladders were broken one of them they had all but one ladder broken so <laughs> i don't know how they they managed that but they did uh so they're seriously they were focusing on those ladders um but the fact that they were breaking them doesn't really make a huge concern to me there like I said it's wood my main concern is that if something happens and they do bring a part of the base down that's the whole point of having the multiple ladders is so that I have a way to get back up in in case but I think once the entire base is done I don't think they're going to go around breaking all the ladders because they're just not going to have access to it they're gonna to have to go way far out of their way to get to those ladders so I don't think they're going to see that as a valid path whereas right now I only had one the one side completed uh, so it's gonna be like we're going to have these alleyways on all four sides. So I think in the future, they're, they're only going to bust one ladder. So that if I do actually fall down or a part of the base falls down, I will be able to get up somehow. I have, I'm confident in that. Oh, look, some of those trees are turning into 1200s. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's going to be some good wood. couple of them look like they're still at 900 though that one and that one but I'm really pleased with uh, how everything went they, they did break into the base but that was okay they didn't do a lot of damage while they were in there and I've taken great pains gone to great pains to make sure that there's nothing in there that they could destroy that would would hurt everything is up here and their intelligence is their weakness. If they were to just randomly go pick a block, the closest one to them, you know, more than likely they would focus more on the structural points. Well, they wouldn't focus. They would just, I think, randomly they would land more on the, the structural points than they did. I made five, uh, five cobblestone or flagstone blocks and I only used four. Only four of the structural blocks were bro broken. Uh, there were damage to more of them but none of them were completely broken. Only four of the the blocks were broken so that uh, a lot more wood was broken and I'm okay with that because it's it's 
fairly cheap and inexpensive. Ooh, I missed the upgrade over there, but I think it's because it was uh, under that barbed wire. I can't, I can't up, uh, repair through the barbed wire. I think I did on one, but I think I just got lucky and landed my mouse just on the right position where I could get to it, and I, I haven't been able to do it on that one. So we did really well on our base. I was happy. Um, I think a lot of uh, a lot of the zombies were from that wandering horde that happened just before, right as the the horde spawned. So I think some of the damage was by them, and I wasn't. Uh, yeah. So we did really good. We did really, really good. They like destroyed a lot of the barbed wire, but we'll get to all of that today. Um, oh, also, we made three levels. We spent all the points um, right before the horde because we made level 20 and we bought our uh, iron tools recipes and we're good <laughs> but we made three levels so that was awesome um i think what i want to do with these points is continue to get these guys worked up to put that point into strength bam and then i, I think the stamina is going to be a a big issue now that we're upgrading the gathering tools to at least iron so we're going to be using a lot more stamina so i think getting that point in there is going to be very very important um and Let's do pack mule because I plan on uh, I plan on going um, looting today once we get our tools and stuff made. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. We're gonna get our uh, tools situated. We're gonna get rid of the stone axe. Oh my gosh, we're gonna unfavorite it. Boo yeah, and we're gonna make. An iron pickaxe. Heck yeah. Oops. Where'd you go? An iron fire axe. Oh yeah, because we don't even have an axe. Uh, <laughs> I've been using just the stone axe. Um, we managed to get like an iron pickaxe on the very first day, I think. But we didn't have a way to repair it, so I never really used it after that. And then we got an iron shovel, but we never got an iron axe. So that's going to be awesome. And I should have enough uh, iron on me to make all a full set of iron tools. So there's um, our shovel. Yes. Heck yeah. All right. And now we need a hoe. I'm not going to favorite this because we should... I've never seen that it takes damage when you actually hoe the ground. So we're not going to need un two of these. So here we go. Bam. <laughs> okay, that's all of our cue points. So what we're going to do is we're going to head over. Where is our workbench? It was over here. We're going to head over there to the workbench and we're going to queue up a couple of pieces of the leather armor. At least the breastplate and the legs. Uh, because we're wearing the padded armor. I would like to get... I mean, we don't need gloves because we have military gloves. I just don't have a way to repair those. Honestly, it might be better um, to to get the leather gloves just so we can replace it and repair it because I mean the the military armor that we have is only tier one and it's it's getting pretty jacked and we have no way to repair it 
Oh, and I didn't make enough duct tape. So let's no, let's just go ahead and make what we got. Make what we got. I can make the gloves some other time. <laughs> but I think the most important thing is uh, the breastplate and the legs. Getting those upgraded. Getting some extra armor. We get a lot of pieces of stuff that only add cold and heat protection. Um, and maybe once, you know, we get more more mods, we'll be able to... Ooh, look at that. Two blueberries in one patch. Wow. Nice. Okay, I think this is the house. This is the house with the workbench. Oh yeah, that was a good find because we would have had to wait until 25 until we've been through here. All the birds' nests are empty. Oh, Mr. Chin! Mr. Chin, you're standing between me and progress. That's not a good place to be. Huh. Oh, he just shrugged that one off. You're a tough one, Mr. Chin. <laughs> Did you see that? He just took it. Oh. Hey, did we? Yeah. Um. Huh. Shiny. Ooh. Uh, let's see. We want the leather chest armor and the leather leg armor. Oh, that's not going to take hardly any time at all. And this should be pretty good. It should be like level four. Oh, yeah. So we should get plenty of mod spots in there for our various stuff and things. Oh yeah. Look at all those tools being spat out at us. All right, so we don't need the stone ax anymore. We can get our pick and our ax. Um, I know I have the steel pickaxe, but I'm just gonna carry this iron one around just for normal stuff and save that steel one because I don't have the ability to make steel so I'm using and I'm gonna have to be very strategic about how I use that so that I don't waste it because it's really awesome for breaking those rocks and getting them cleaned up uh, pretty darn quick so let's put uh, one of the modifiers in here I'm really excited about using these we're gonna put the custom fitting one in there Oh yeah, and then we're gonna put our other one in the other piece and it'll be like, so the mobility is, uh, this one takes away two from the mobility penalty and the other one does three, so it's like we're not wearing any armor at all. <laughs> uh, so yeah, look, oh, how come that only... That still lists it as 2%. Let's um, let's take that out and see. All right, now let's look at it. It says four, okay? So it's only taken 2% off and not the three like it says on there. So that's interesting. I think that's a little bugged, uh, but still, I, I want to wear the leather armor for the extra protection uh, because, look, this gives us four armor and four percent resistance and this one only gives us two, so we're doubling the armor in there and not taking as big of a penalty. So that is super awesome and we're gonna I made another shovel and we're gonna go ahead and melt this one down. I was almost gonna repair it. I had the iron on me and I was like, eh, I don't know. We're also, I had that wood splitter in the, the stone axe. So we're gonna put it in our fire axe. So there we go. So it'll be a wood chopping fool. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> so we got a lot of stuff. Uh, we made the hoe. Oh, we need the hammer. We need to make a hammer because 
this is my repair tool slash wood chopping tool. I've been using the crap out of it. So we're going to make the hammer and the knife is what is left. Oh, I didn't favorite it. Oh, crap. Okay. There we go. So we got all the tools. We got a whole spread of tools today. Wow. Um, I'm curious. I know I put, did I put a point into mother load or not? I put a point into strength, so I should do more damage from it. Okay, so I haven't really done anything directly to the mother load or the minor 69er. So let's see how many hits does it take to bust down one of these rocks. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So <laughs> it's still a lot better to use that steel to go around and gather the stone to get the iron. That's good to know that because uh, the steel took only four hits to break down each level of the rock. So it was 12 total to, uh, to kill a whole entire rock. So that would be 21. So that's almost, uh, you know, cutting down 50% of the strikes that I need. Hello, Mr. Chin. Oh, we need to make a sledgehammer. I completely forgot we can make a sledgehammer because right now we can only put one, one modifier in there and that one is taken. So if we get another one, we can't really put it in there. Ah, uh, see, I can't hit my little guys anymore. Because I don't want to waste iron. <laughs> when it was just stone, it was okay. When I was doing the stone axe, it was okay to go around and whack in those little uh, bushes that give you wood. But I don't want to waste it on a, an iron tool. So, I guess I, won't, I just won't hit anymore. Alright, we got, we got all our tools upgraded. I need to... Let's look at that sledgehammer because I forgot all about it. We can totally make this now. It takes 30 iron! Oh my gosh! We're gonna have to go, uh, go put that. Look, we got 34. That's about what I was getting with the steel. So it doesn't give you more from the rocks to upgrade the tools. It's only skill that will give you more. Oh man, I'm so excited to to get more done on the base, but I've, I've really been fo so focused on the base the last couple of episodes, uh, last couple of game days that I really want to do something else. I want to go out and loot something I don't, we don't have enough for the hammer. All right, bum deal. So I'm gonna have to go mining in order to get enough iron for the hammer. We got, maybe if we make one more tick, we, we can make 30 now. So there we go. Um, we'll put this over here and we're gonna leave our hammer. Um, 74, yeah, I think we'll sell those. Um, we can, we can only drop our bone shiv. Now we got a hunting knife. That's good. Oh, we can melt this shovel down. I forgot about that. Bye, little stone axe. You were my friend for so long. I'm sorry to have to just, just destroy you like that. <laughs> I really did use the crap out of that tool, I'm telling you. Alright, let's get some of this stuff put away so we can go on an adventure. Um, I guess we're going to put the hoe in here and we'll put the... Sh no, we're going to take the shovel with us. We're going to put this one in the forge over here. And hope... Oh, we cheated 
It does that. That's a bug, I think, that uh, if you have like this iron and it has a timer on there and you put a tool in, it will only use that few seconds left. Like that was that timer, but it wasn't. So that's a little bit buggy, but I don't think it's, you know, too horribly bad. I'm gonna have to, like probably tonight, overnight, I'll spend some time. Ooh, let's eat before we go. Oh, that's not where my food is. It's not there yet. All right, I don't want to eat another one. That should get us well over a hundred. And let's go ahead. We're going to fill up our water and we're going to drink another one just so we're good and full on our hydration. I think what we're going to do, we're going to head to that rally point. So where is our rally point now? It's a good distance away. Is it in the other direction? Oh, there it is. Okay. It's to the north. I'm hoping that's not in the desert. Because this part is desert over here. So I'm hoping that that's actually in this biome. The, <laughs> the frozen biome. Otherwise, we could be in trouble. The, the hot... Uh, we're going north. Almost due north. The hot zones are going to be a problem for us because we don't have uh, stuff that gives us much heat resistance. I mean, the big thing is the puffer coat that we have, but it only gives two heat resistance. Uh, this only gives two heat resistance. This only gives four, and this gives four, so we don't have that much. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's just go. Let's just go and not worry about it. I don't want to have to carry multiple uh, armor sets around with me just to deal with the heat. Ooh. Oh, man. Thought two birds' nests. Whoa, but I've already been over here. I've been close. Uh, been to pretty much everywhere close by cutting down trees and whatnot picking up all the garbage <laughs> oh wow look at that oh we've seen that POI before okay I know what what one that is so we haven't actually cleared this one out because I didn't even know it was there but we've been to those in another season one of the previous seasons so uh, if we run out of things to do close by, that's a good one to go through. I like that. And we've seen uh, this one too. It's good to know they're sprinkled around all over the place. I would like to find um, another trader. That's what I would like. And possibly not in a frozen biome. Just so you know, I don't know. I don't know why. There's a couple of blueberries. I really want to get those, but uh, if we're going to a rally point, we're going to need, you know, all the space we can to carry all our loot back, hopefully. <laughs> so what I might do, I don't know. I like having the mod in my compound bow. But at 25, we're gonna we're gonna be able to make our own compound bow. Did okay? He did, oh, he saw me. What? I'm sneaking. Oh. Oh yeah. So we totally need to get food because I. Uh, you know, I've only got, I've got like less than 10 of these bacon and eggs and I don't really have a lot of meat, but now we can do farming. 
Oh, and we made another level skin and a deer. Oh, yeah. I'm hoping this rally point isn't a very large one because it's going to take us, it's going to be like 12 o'clock before we ever get there. Whew. I do, uh, oh my god, I don't think I can handle a bear. There's a bear that just spawned over there. It's nice that it looks like this is heading into um, a temperate biome, not a hot or cold, just a normal one. So that's good. Those are the ones that I prefer, but I just, you know, just have not been... Oh man, you know, if they gave more meat, it might even be worth the risk to get that bear, but... He's not going to give much more than the normal amount of meat that a dog would drop. So he's going to be... Oh, 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 I missed. And... Mm -hmm. Oh, bada bing. I love seeing them guys go flying. Oh, my goodness. What the heck? Today is Sunday. That shouldn't be going off. Look, there's two birds' nests! Yes! I need all the eggs I can get. <coughs> oh, yeah! And we still need feathers for our arrows and whatnot, so... Uh, I'm gonna be using a lot of arrows still. Okay, where is this rally point? We're, we're still quite a bit, 300 meters away. We're still quite, I was wondering if it was gonna be one of these houses. I was like, oh man, those are pretty big, but it looks like it's gonna be over this hill maybe. Oh no, it's, look, there's the desert over there. That's no good. I hope our thing isn't gonna be in the desert. Oh look, here's a biker dude. Let's go introduce him to our hammer. Mr. Biker Dude, can you help me out? I want to do test and see how many hits it takes to knock you down. <laughs> One! <laughs> One! But you got back up, so good on you. <laughs> love it, I love it. Oh, up the hill, up the hill. Gotta get up that hill. Man, it's really close now. It's gonna be like right next to this hill. What the heck? Okay, so I don't think it's gonna be quite in the desert, but maybe partially. Um... Those buildings are disappearing and reappearing. Okay, so we got close to it. Okay, now it's a little bit further away. So one of these nearby houses. Oh, there it is. That one that's completely broken in half. And it's in the desert, but it's raining. And I don't think we're going to want to spend a lot of time here uh, since it is going to be hot. So we're going to have to bust it out and get through it because we're sweltering. Oh, Nikki, this is not the time, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know. It's hot. It's hot. We should grab some of that yucca but it's too late we're already in in the wet if we get wet that cools us off it looks like there's a light there we need to go in which is good because uh, it's very hot Oh, we're going to make a noise when we go down this, too. <laughs> shh, 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 shh. 
Oh, Nikki, now is not the time. Look, it's got little red lips. Now is not the time for love, Nikki. Please. Please, baby. I can't. Oh, she's crawling in my lap. Oh, we might need those medical supplies. Let's go ahead and risk losing that. Oh, seriously? Oh, no. Oh, okay, okay. She's like off. Well, the iron arrows and... Okay, I thought that was a zombie. Let's look around up top. It's, a lot of the floor is missing, so the zombie... I've never been in this type of uh, POI before. It's totally trashed. I hate it. Stuff is parts of the floor miss oh my god look I wouldn't know that there were guys there except you can see the little particle effects on them uh, no Nikki come on Let mommy play dude Oh, there's a passing gas crate. Oh, that's so awesome. Okay, let's... We're undercover. Oh, there's a guy. You can see the little particle effects. Totally giving their position away. You guys should turn that off. Okay, he's awake. Oh, no. We woke somebody up. Crap. See him. We're gonna have to. Oh, a leather duster. <clears throat> Hold on. If we wear this leather duster, we'll lose a nine cold resist, but we'll pick up some heat resist. So we'll definitely want to put that on. That should help. <clears throat> what the heck? <laughs> What are we supposed to... Oh, dude! Seriously, cat! You're freaking me out here! Okay, sorry. <laughs> Jesus keeps... No, no, go on. Go on. <sighs> she just keeps walking in front of the monitor and... I hear stuff breaking. somebody laying over there but I, I can't get them because they're actually in the bed everybody's woke up oh god this is horrible taking my pathway back oh that's probably a mistake oh crap Nikki That doesn't fall. Oh, it wasn't a zombie. I thought the log was a zombie. Oh, I see a guy. Oh, man. Why? The zoom doesn't work all the time. Oh, he's got it right in his forehead. There we go. We took care of him. Go on, Nikki. Shoo, shoo. Okay, there's a guy in there. Oh, seriously? 
I can't see him. Zombies, I, can't, I don't even know where they are. And they're aggroed on me. I mean, like, I can't see them. How can they see me? This is ridiculous. Okay, he's out there. Oh, let's get that before he destroys it. Awesome. Okay, we're gonna loot this place up once. I don't think we're supposed to go this way. Ah, here there's a ladder. You can barely see it. <coughs> who's it? Who's there? Ooh, more medical supplies. I'm definitely gonna... Ah! Schnickerdoodles. Okay. Is this, like, the end? Um... I don't think we cleared all the zombies. There's an orange dot. I think maybe we might need to continue on. That looks like it's going to break. It didn't. can hear a zombie. Oh, that looks horrible. Where are you, zombies? Oh. be on the outside. Oh, they're going to go where I can't hit them. Oh, man. <laughs> I have no idea where this stupid zombie is. Alright, well. <laughs> Actually, it looks like we could go down here. And then jump up. Oh! Oh! He was a sneaky Hyder McHyderson. Oh, he, he went down. He went down. Oh, yes, we did it. All right, we're done. So that other guy wasn't a part of this. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Medical supplies, baby. A blood bag. Some weapons bag. Ooh, two pistols. They're pretty jacked, though. Uh, 20 nails and a hubcap. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, a level two wrench, baby. Yes. I'm glad we found that leather duster. That is awesome. Um, I think it might be better to have our prior axe here instead of the pick. We could probably leave that. Uh, I don't know why I made the pick. So I like using the hammer a lot, but sometimes the hammer doesn't give you materials when you break things. So I guess it's good to have it. Oh, he looks angry. You shot me with your arrows. Now I have to carry them around for all eternity. He's trying to get me so bad. Oh no, you fall down. Okay, there's still another one out there, but I want to loot. I want to loot the rest of this place. Uh, are any of these lootable? No. Uh, there's a little kitchen area down there I'd like to loot. Heck yeah, I want to loot everything. All the stuff and things. And we pretty much got all the, the guys killed in here. Oh man, Nikki. Nikki. Come on. She's being a turd head. We're gonna scrap the... Oh, I should have... I should have used those. I'm such a... Ninny. We have iron arrows now. It's, uh... It's better to just make them up. Get them cobblestone rocks. Yeah, it's gonna make our base stronger. Um... Let's go out here and take care of this dude that won't leave us alone. Hey. Butthead. <laughs> Get those arrows. Oh, bada bing. There we go. Okay. Now we can go back in and loot it up. Well, it's also good that man it's uh it's raining out yeah help cool us off in this heat but i think it's because part of the biome is we're gonna scrap these oh um, maybe the nails i'm so scared i'm gonna destroy something I shouldn't. There, that should help a little. Because, uh, yeah, we're going to start needing these. Need all the springs, and we get a good amount of metal out of there, too. Okay, I think that's everything there. <laughs> Did we miss out on the kitchen? Medical supplies. Oh, a med kit. Oh my goodness. That was my cat. Can she come over? Nudged my hand. I thought there was the kitchen up there. How did we miss it? Oh no, there it is. Okay, okay. I was like, what? That's crazy. Alright. So we got this bathroom looted up. Uh, nothing really in here to loot. On that, here's the kitchen. It's just a couple of cupboards. Um, yeah. Oh, yes, there's our battery acid. That is awesome. Uh, oh, we already, we, we drank a water when we got here, so that's good. And we got a little bit of coffee, a couple of glass bottles, excellent. I think that's a door to the outside. Oh, 
<laughs> we're level 25 now you know what that means oh my goodness today was a good day um because now we can do the advanced engineering and get a workbench we can go home and make a compound oh this is the best day ever oh yeah okay so now we need to go through the little <laughs> maze that was the door from the other side nothing over here to loot um there might i don't know it looks like there might be stuff over there look i can see at least uh A little blue bag of stuff <laughs> and this and we need to see if there's something behind the pictures oh there's a, like a little alcove over here wonder if they hid something <laughs> oh yeah a purse with some ammo in it and one of these guys. Let's uh, grab up as much of that as we can since it's taken up a spot in our inventory. Uh, I think that's the outside wall, so we don't need to tear that down. Okay, awesome. Got a little cobblestone. Uh, I haven't seen a lot of the like curtains that give you plastic when you break them. Um, definitely, let's get our shovel back out. I definitely want to grab these because that's dirt I don't have to mine. <laughs> there we go. Excellent. And I believe that leads around to the other side. I think we start over there. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, oh, we can turn all these into cloth fragments. Um, get rid of that. We might want to save some of them since we're going to be farming and we can make a cotton farm. And then we don't have to worry about it. Oh, I forgot about that crate. We got a passing gas crate. Bam and bam. They changed the the wheel, how it looks. That looks so so much more real than the other ones. The other ones look sort of like maybe a, a bicycle tire, but those look like actual wheels. Nice. Oh, and a purse we didn't get. With a pistol. I think we're gonna go ahead and scrap that pistol. Let's look. Let's, let's scrap it. Do we, I don't think we have mechanical parts, but we'll scrap it anyway. It's only worth seven. Um, yeah, I think we might scrap these other pistols too because we got, well, I know we got a couple pistols at home. And that'll save up. Uh, a little bit more room. Oh yeah, get just cobblestone rocks. Excellent. Oh yeah, you don't know how horrible it was for me to walk past these coming in. Yeah, let it rain, let it rain. <laughs> Cause uh, it's hot over here. Oh yeah, that's awesome. So, I think what we have is the same. And I like I like the overall look. Yeah, I like the overalls better. So we'll take it in case we I change my mind and decide I like the pants look better. <laughs> oh look, those are bricks that we can harvest. Oh Nikki, please stop. I know. I will take care of you. I promise. What if I'm not taking care of you? I definitely want to grab those bricks because those, it's just, 
it's too easy to get the rocks. They give such good rocks. It's hard to pass it up. It's better than breaking uh, the other ones. <laughs> I'm having to play with one hand right now because Nikki, Nikki is being very insistent that I pay attention to her and listen to her. She knows I'm not. And plus, look at that. That was 552 experience. That's freaking awesome. Oh, yeah. So let's take a look around the outside of this house because I was in such a hurry to get in when we got here uh, that I, I didn't really look. But I want to make sure, you know, I've never been to this POI before, so I want to make sure I don't miss anything cool. Oh, look at that. Even with the rain and the duster, um, I guess we don't really have any shorts. Oh, look, we got to be a good neighbor. Check the mail. these chairs. It's free wood. Okay, that looks like it. That was awesome. That's a new POI I've never been in before. It's pretty cool. We're a little bit in the desert, but um, let's look. I want to try and, well, we got stuff at home. Uh, let's do this. That I, I tossed out that other. Okay, I want to make sure we get like at least four cotton while we're over here. Oh man, I can't move and I don't think I see any more cotton. Oh look. Hello little guy, I didn't see you there in the bushes. <laughs> Alright, we'll just be on the lookout for some cotton. Make sure we grab at least three more. It's raining and it's hot. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm gonna have to get get home and end the episode because Nikki is being crazy right now. Look at that road. That is not a road I want to go on. Look at that. <laughs> like, just cut the freaking mountain down. I don't think you could actually get up that with a vehicle. I don't know though. I, I only had a 4x4 four four for a little while in the very first season of 17. I really like the, um, the vehicles though. Getting, you know, not just having the mini bike. Uh, having the, mo the motorcycle was freaking awesome. Oh, so is the 4x4. Four four. I can't wait to... I hope that we can play this a little bit to where we can get deeper into the skill trees and and have some fun with stuff like that. Um, let's... That'll lighten the load a little bit. Oh... Yeah, I've already been through here. <laughs> I shouldn't have to loot anything on the way back because I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait. Let's get this cotton. We need a couple more. I want to make sure... Oh, let's go over this field and just grab a couple. I shouldn't have turned all that stuff in the cloth, but I was thinking to conserve space. And let's grab like four more. One, two... Three and the four. Okay. That's good. Now we can clear this up. Put that up there. I'm missing something. Oh, the shovel. Put that up there. Make sure I don't lose my tools. Oh, yeah. That was a good run. Oh, I missed a bird's nest. What? <laughs> That's crazy. Um... I want to get like the 
and stuff, but it's not like a high priority. I'll eventually get it. Um, I think once we get into farming, which I want to do straight away because we have the tools now. I spent the point living off the land. If I didn't, I have a point. Um, and we can get a farm going because getting uh, vegetable stew, I have extra meat. I just don't have, you know, I don't have the eggs and getting the farm going will be able to put potatoes and corn with that meat and make meat stew so we can at least use it and have some type of food instead of just plain grilled the grilled meat i think that's a waste of meat because it gives you so little out of it you only get like 10 max stamina for five meat and <laughs> it just uh, it makes me sad look here's like a little wandering horde <coughs> oh, but, uh, this is bad. It's good and bad. Cause, I mean, it's good that we got experience, but it's bad because I'm encumbered and I'm moving really slow. So they could totally overwhelm me if I'm not careful. Oh, it's good to be back in the cold. The cold biome. I'm going to have to put the puffer coat back on, too, before I forget. Oh, look at all these guys. They're still just wandering through. <laughs> Bam! What? Oh, no! No, no! No, no, no! <laughs> Just for that, dear sir, you shall take an arrow to the eye. Did it go in his eye? Oh, it didn't stay. That's that's a shame. All right, whack you. Hit you while you're down. Ooh, that looked like it hurt. Oh, yeah, uppercut. Oh, yeah, I one shot at her. Big mama. She's a tough one to take down. Oh, yeah, since I'm flying. Better up. Oh, yeah, there we go. Good stuff. Oh, man. Ugh. I can make it. I can make it. Here we go. Um, we actually have an empty slot or two. So let's go straight to the trader. And then we'll turn in the quest. And we'll call it an episode. Might be a little bit early. But I think that's okay. Uh, because I'm just going to go run to the base. And then empty my pockets. I'll probably first, before I do that, I'll pause the game and go take care of Nikki because she's tormenting me. <laughs> oh, Mr. Chin, Mr. Chin, I'm so happy to see you be back in my cold biome with all the chins wandering around. Oh, no, mistakes were made. Oh, there we go. There we go. Whew. Yep, one little misstep and he didn't go flying back and was able to hit me. That's okay, though. We deserve to get hit every now and then. It gives us a little bit of humility. Let's just know we're not perfect. Pretty damn close, but not perfect. Just sometimes bad things happen to good people for no reason. Um, I, I think with um, us not having uh, enough cold armor, we might need to look into that snowberry extract because that's supposed to help. And 
and possibly look into oh well now that we got farming we could get coffee which should also help because that should help give us like a little buff and we're down on food so let's go ahead and eat we could probably use a sip yeah not too shabby I really like how they've um, added that little buffer to where you know you can you can overeat so you can go into those places knowing you're well fed and you don't have to bother eating again until after you're done I really really like that because it's not um, I mean like it's there like you know you have to to eat to take care of yourself so that you don't die but at the same time it's not too bothersome to be like oh god I gotta eat again yes Nikki I know baby I know I'm doing my best I'm hurrying we'll get we'll get you taken care of it's oh, oh my god it's like nine o'clock and I haven't eaten She's freaking out. She's like, it's normally 6. 6.45. I give you three, two hours. <laughs> and nothing. She's being a turd head, but I'll take care of her. You know I'll take care of you, Nikki. I know I can't. I got like almost 2,000 stone on me and I can't help it. I got to pick this up. It's, it's like free loot just laying there on the ground. And I just can't pass up free loot. I just can't. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Oh, trash. <laughs> hey, we're going there so we can sell that. And we're going to get a little bit of cash. So that's good. Oh, honestly, I'll stop looting. I'll stop looting. Um... There's the sign. No. I think this is the front though. No. Oh, I went the wrong. I guess you can't really go the wrong way. It all leads around. So wow, I thought I was actually gonna be ending it early and it should be right about right, about 18 o'clock. Awesome, we're almost there. Uh, it's getting a little bit easier to get around with all those points and pack mule. It'll makes it makes us go faster when we're carrying a full load, so that's good. Hello, traveler. Hello, trader Bob. It must be my lucky day. Oh, Thank I think I'm gonna take a look at all nine first aid bandages. Oh no, I'm like completely, we're going to go ahead and scrap this just because I need two slots, one for the coins and one for the bandages. There we go. All right, let's look. Okay, we got it. Awesome. Nine bandages. That is awesome. Let's get another job. Hopefully he's got a clear at 1.4. Look at this. I mean, there's two towns right around you, Bob. This is ridiculous. You should, it's a tier one. You should be really close, close to home. Yeah, I think that should be part of like the programming is that the tier ones have like a limited radius around it. And the further that radius is, the higher the difficulty of the tier should be. Do me a favor. Because you have that ability to travel further and further because you should have, you know, you should have a vehicle of some sort by that time. Awesome. I don't think we really got that much to sell, uh, but we did get a lot of stuff to take home. So we're going to go ahead and call Thank it here and I'll make the rest of the Check way home get new off camera, out, empty my pockets, clean it up, do some looting, hopefully get a little bit more done on the base. And then we'll see you guys next time. And we're going to get a workbench. It's awesome.
anyway thank you for watching and bye bye